my vision at the end of the red tent and what I said I wanted to do was to have a clearinghouse in Facebook about what's going on in Los Angeles. Great so idea. People wanted to mobilize. And I found something. And didn't I tell you what it was? Like resistance rising or something? Maybe there's all kinds. Look, here's the but thing. Here's, know, here's, here's the, um, here's well, the group. Uh, I'll tell you the group. Uh, wait, wait. I want to say this is so essential. I'm telling this for myself first. Because this is not the time for people just staying home and talking in two words. I agree. It's so, so time to make sure that each one of us is taking an action of protection, of connection, of an information. I agree. I 100% agree. What I, what I would request, since I personally think I have a, 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 an idea that has a, who knows, some percentage of chance of succeeding. It's the clearest, most loving idea possible, and I would love supporting getting it out there. What is it? It's exactly what I said. It's, yes, make boundaries against racism and hatred, okay? Have, have a value. This is it. It's to, get to, it's to create, unite the central core of Americans who have their own personal boundaries against anybody getting, you know, you know, against p police brutality, who don't want, uh, uh, you know, who want equality. They just want to have everyone get along fine and have a good life, okay? The bulk of the Americans, not the people who are all the way out there on the side saying everything that's got to be their way progressive and not the way the people who are all the way on the other side that are saying, you know, kill everybody except the white males. But the bulk of people want a good life, okay? They're tired of the politicians. Okay, can they agree on how to get there? No, not particularly. But they can agree on values, and they can agree that Trump doesn't hold those values, okay? The, 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 if you chunk it up, you can get people into an agreement. Towards well, unity. Said, towards unity. No one's working towards unity enough. That's where I think it needs to be. Let everyone protest who wants to protest. But then try it. The, 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 the thing to do tomorrow is not to call up a single Democrat or progressive that you know, unless to tell them, get on the phone and talk to every person you know that voted for Trump and see if you can get them to come to the rally. That's the only what's going to happen. You have to talk to your friends who voted for Trump so we can have the conversation. Process. It's the only fucking way to, to make it happen. The on, Democrats you can aren't do that on the point Monday is Monday well, versus mobilizing for a presence that You're is, saying on Monday? No, I'm saying Here's the thing. this weekend I don't think to have a platform to say this is tweet what we, war. Tweet war. We have to do a tweet war. We have to do okay. we do it. Need to I, I, mean, I think tweeting is the best. That sounds good. I think good. we need to flood the thing and say, if you agree, click here. But do it. Also, do it. Write also, it. Write it. I've never done a tweet before in my life. Okay. Okay. The thing this is, is good. I want it to, to reality. We are going to say, let's be all for the lovey two shoe. All it's the not good lovey two shoe. It's fine commonality. Okay. But I'm talking about <laughs> bitter, angry parents fighting over what they're going to do with their kids, finding commonality. I, it's beautiful. And now, based on what you just told me, of what are we going to say? What are we going to face? What we are going to face in terms If it of, goes that way, yes, exactly. If, if anybody will, t you know, will be a little bit louder. If everybody will be, if somebody will get hurt and shot, and it's going to happen. Say, and he will find, and, and he will find records, and he will shame, and he will do and, like dirty. Wait, and, wait, 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 wait. Yes, so, go ahead. And the thing is, this movement, and the media will make it up. This movement, based on what we acknowledge and how dirty things can happen. Yes. With this movement will face with a lot of adversity and a lot of pressure, and there will be all kinds of ways of people within the within that group that will have different ways of approaching having their life being vi you know their life will be violated. Some people more than others, but I'm yes, saying absolutely. we have to be prepared. Yes. This movement yes. for hardcore issues of how to deal with. Battle, how to deal when your life is going to be violated? You know, are you going to be a, a, an angry mob or are you going to be a protest, a peaceful protester, and you're not going to raise an arm? Because 
but the scenarios we have to be prepared for to be compliant. I agree. I 100% agree. Should we go out and buy guns? I think so. I, I mean, it's silly to think that. And you're but going to, here's the, the look. That's why I think this is the only problem. look. This is why I think that I haven't heard any other idea that that has a possibility. It's because number one, the Democrats and the progressives, no matter how fucking loud they get, don't have enough power to do anything right now. All they can do is somehow vote two years from now. They have. You know, they're not have zero representation in the White House or the cabinet. They're they're under they're the minority in the House. They're the minority in the Senate, and they're about to be the minor. They're right now even and about to be the minority in the Supreme Court. So we'd have no fucking leverage. The only way that we can get that leverage is to make our group, our mass, bigger. The only way we can make our mass bigger is to chunk it up. Is to look to higher values and get Peace, started with those justice, people. Liberty, even even no one gets killed unless they've broken. You know, it's like safety. It's the norm, the way we know basic it. All right, human and basic human rights. Exactly. We go up to the. We chunk. We that. simply say, look, we want to get the people together, get them not informed, get them starting to talk about deeper issues, more chunked down issues. But first, we want to say. Anyone interested in saving the United States, working together to keep this fucking nightmare from happening from either side, and you could talk about all the nightmares that could happen. Anyone who's interested in that would like to see this future, and you could talk about the future that could exist, okay? Interested in joining this or being on this newsletter or, or somehow making this happen. When you get that kind of base and it starts to come out and you have interesting people doing it, let me, let me just go. You, you, start, you don't, no, no, you let the platform come. The platform starts with values that everyone can agree with, okay? That's if you don't I agree mean, in the equality, then you're not going to be interested. You'll be in the alt-right. You won't be interested. But if you basically believe, you'll be in 90% of it will believe in equality and so forth, okay? You're not talking about any specifics at that point. Below that, you could say the, the 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 issues that we will talk about are the things we're all interested in 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 abortions rights and women's rights in war in peace in equality in safety in security. We're interested in all those, and we all have different ideas of how they can how they can be decided. Okay, so we're going to have committees. We're going to have people working together. You're going to have. Anyone who has a voice from this end to this end, talk about it, and we'll look about what those values are, like talk about security. Let's talk about abortion. Hot button fucking issue, right? And you've got people who say it should never happen. You have people who say it should happen at whim, basically, okay? But all of them, or 90% of them, will agree that there ought to be less abortions, that no one's really in favor of abortion, okay? What they would like is less unwanted pregnancies. They would like general, everyone pretty much agrees it'd be nice if there were less abortions. The people had less reasons to have to have abortions. Maybe we had better uh, education. Maybe we had, we had all kinds of things. New science. What if instead of having an abortion, you had it implanted in, a, in someone who wants to have a baby? Okay, who knows what could happen? The point is you get them to at the point of agreement on an idea you don't have to implement later. When they're working together, you can find the solutions, I promise you. The reason we don't find solutions isn't because they aren't there. It's because we're too fucking, we've got power struggle going on. We've got politics going on. We've got everything going on that gets in the way of finding solutions and compromising things that will wake. And if 10 years, if, if someone is really irrational enough to believe that they wouldn't sign on for an agreement that said in 10 years from now, this is someone who's absolutely anti-abortion. Intent, right now it's going to be legal and we're going to work it out through science and education and stuff. But in 10 years from now, there'll be 80% less abortions in the country and that'll be by choice. Choice will still be there, but there'll be 80% abortions and less abortions. Don't you think even the most right wing would ha say, you know what? I'll just relax. If you could promise me that, I'll relax. And I'm willing to work for that as a future. Now, the other people who, who want complete pro-choice, and you're saying there'd be complete choice, well, I would work towards that. I don't want to have abortions. I don't. It, yes, I'm so fervent about abortions because what I had to go through to have an abortion and, how, and, and, and my friend who couldn't have it or whatever, who died, 
You know, I mean, look, I grew up, uh, my first abortion, it wasn't legal at the time. Okay. So the point is on every issue, there's commonality. If, if people are willing to look for it, if you've got a group of people who basically say, we're in this to make things better. We don't give a fuck what they're doing in Washington right now. But no, we do give a fuck because we're going to tell each of our Congress persons or each of our senators that these are the values you want to be voting on. And unless this vote you're doing doesn't fit within this value, we don't want you to be voting that. And if the value is equality, then when you sign something, we want to make sure it means fairness and equality. That's how you have power, but you do it because you've broadened the fucking base of the good guys, of the non-crazies, which are much bigger, which is 80% of the people. That's what I think can work. Because what else can work? We can protest. We know what's going to happen when we protest. We can assassinate. We know what will happen if we assassinate. So let's let's put that into action. How can we put that into action? That's what politics attempting to put into it's action. It's not. It's fucking so not here's trying the way, to do it here's at all. The way you put it in action. You put down the three to five to seven points of what those shared values are, you start to send it around, yeah, let it go group. viral, create, create, let it go viral. It. And then the next question is that, so when anybody says, because having a shared narrative of what this movement represents. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. as simple. So write it down. Get your I want to say what I'm going to do right now. Okay. And then wait a minute. Wait a minute. I want to say what I'm going to do right now. I want to make sure. Okay. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to put this out there. I'm going to edit it. Okay. I'm going to put it out there on a Facebook thing as a rant, as a as a whatever with with the audio or you know an edited audio and and you know an article, okay? okay so and I'm going to see what the fuck people say. Sure. Okay. So you can do it that way.